back in Washington, talks appear to be stalled on a deal to raise the debt ceiling and avoid major financial fallout for the country. Economists warn if there is no agreement by the end of the month, 401ks could plunge and the economy could tip into a deep recession. Scott McFarlane is on Capitol Hill. Scott, good morning. Vlad, good morning to you. One week and one day until this June 1st deadline, the Treasury Department's X date, the date in which the economy could suffer an immediate shock. But now some House Republicans are questioning that deadline itself. House Majority Leader Steve Scalise said yesterday, we'd like to see more transparency on how they came up with that date and came to that date, which opens up concern that if GOP members don't even agree on the deadline, both sides still remain far apart. But the bottom line remains the same. Republicans want the president to cut spending and Democrats will spend part of this day criticizing Republicans for trying to cut access to nutritional benefits, nutritional assistance and other social programs. And last night ended with a dizzying mix of optimism and pessimism. Senate Republican leader Mitch McConnell told an audience yesterday people should, quote, relax and that America won't default. But time is tight. House leaders want to put the bill in front of their members for three days before any vote. And then there's Memorial Day. And the House Speaker said last night he's uncertain if he'll keep the House in session until a deal is done. Tony. All right, Scott, thank you very much. For